Shata. Haji Muhammad Azizan, Malaysia. Maslinda, our chair umpire, will do the coin toss. Final who gets the serve? Players get to warm up. Matthias Bo there on the back of your screens together with Mark Zwiebler, the two international imports of Team Philippines. Matthias Bo did his very best in his tie-up together with Ronen Estanislao and they went down fighting. The Indonesian pair of Angara Pratama and Ryan Agung, 21-16, 21-7. Right now the focus is on that man there, Toby Gadi. Antonino Benjamin Gaddy is his full name from the Philippines playing right-handed you see his height and his weight he has been the top singles player in the Philippines for the past two and a half years right now trying to show his wares here in Kuala Lumpur Junisius Hayum Rumbaka ranked 24 in the world age 24 standing at 182 centimeters It'll be a good challenge here for Gadi. And of course, talking to the coaches of the Philippines, Bog Zamahit and Vika Sunshon. More than anything else, they want to stay competitive, but it's very crucial for them to be able to get as much experience as they possibly can. Maslinda is our chair umpire. And she will be assisted by Muhammad Azizan Ali from Malaysia. As we still have our players warming up and that is the brain trust. The coaching staff right now of Indonesia. They're already formally into the semi-finals with their victory in the first singles and the doubles. But of course they'd like to have a clean sweep because they're looking to top this bracket if they possibly can. That's gonna set up a mouth-watering affair Tomorrow night, our third and final day of the group stages as we pit Malaysia and Indonesia to find out who will come out on top here in Kuala Lumpur. There is Bogs Amahit, one of the coaches of Team Philippines. And we're just about ready to get underway for our final match of the evening. And let's meet the players, courtesy of Maslinda. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Philippines, represented by Antonio Benjamin Gadi. And on my left, Indonesia Rajawali, represented by Donisius Hayum Rumbaka. Indonesia Rajawali to serve, level, play. First point goes to Gadi. So it's over. One, love. As Mark Zwiebler moves over to the coach's seat, trying to add a little bit more experience there on the coaching bench for Team Philippines. He did not see action here today. Easy put away there by so it's over. Rumbaka. One, all. And very quickly, two, it's now 2-1 one one. for Team Indonesia. Gadi just can't return that one. Straight to his body. 3-1. 4 
one. Just no head-to-head -head matchups yet between these two gentlemen. Gadi slowly but surely trying to get some international experience. And what better way than going up against the world number 24. Easy kill there by Rumbaka going down the line. Five, one. And again just stamping his class. goes long Gadi trying his best One. to extend the points lengthen the rally but still in the end point goes to Indonesia point there for Gadi so now 2-6 2-6 Easy put away. Sevisova. Bad position there Seven, on the return by two. Gadi. Taken advantage of by Rumbaka. Yeah. Just out of Gadi's reach. Again, Eight, Rumbaka using two. the entire court. Trying to go down the line. Misses is Gadi. Nine, two. It's now 9-2. It's a very quiet stadium right now. A while ago, it was rocking. When Malaysia was playing Thailand. Most of the fans have gone home, but Gadi picks up a point here. So it's Three, now 2-9. So it's over. 10-3. It's now 10-3. And just 11, like that, interval. we reach the interval. And as expected, Indonesia comfortably ahead, 11-3. sure you can say too much to Hayum Rumbaka after this overpowering performance here in the first stage of our very first game our third match of the evening Philippines versus Indonesia he's done everything right Gadi picks up a point here of that good attack it's now 4-11 Short ball, still returned, but nonetheless, Gadi picks up another one. It's now 5-11. That goes wide. Well, I guess what the coach had to tell Rumbaka was continue pouring on the pressure. It seems like he's lifted his foot off the pedal just a little bit. 
That's right, it's got to go to Gadi. He's been a little bit more aggressive that time though, sending it long. Now 12-6. Now starting to regain his bearings is Rumbaka. Seven. Opens up a six point advantage here. Oh. Not the best of returns 14, there from Gadi, it's another point for Indonesia. From Baka. I'll just opt in to keep it in play. Just out of the reach of Gadi. Well played once again by Rumbaka. Just out of Gadi's reach. Wow, thunderous kill there from the back. 16, 7. That elicits an applause, and why not? Booming smash. It is now 16, 7. That put away, not good enough. It goes long. 17, seven. And another point here for Indonesia. Eighteen. Quick point that seven. time, that's a gift. Trying to go for the kill with the backhand, just it's sending that one. wide. Eight, eighteen. Oh, nice recovery by it's Rumbaka. Just when it looked like 19, that point should have been Gadi's. Unforced errors, 10 already for Toby Gadi. Oh, that's a poor smash. A little bit too over eager and he breaks a string. Once again, we can't thank Akshata enough for coming up with an event such as this one. Aside from it being very original, it's giving badminton that well-needed shot in the arm. This the richest team event in the sport of badminton, the Akshata Cup. Six countries, eight teams. And when we reach the okay. semi-final yeah. stage, it'll be a home and away format never done before in the sport of badminton. That's the best way to bring out the fans. Get them cheering for their squad. Nice put away by Rombaka. 
action. It's over. He waited for the right opportunity, Wendy didn't force the action. Nine. And it's now game point for Indonesia. Wrong further at that time was Gadi. Gay. And it's an emphatic 21 9 victory here in game Indonesia, number one for Indonesia. Nine. Just too much talent behind Rumbaka there. As you can see, Gadi scrambling just to get that back. back to the stadium badminton Kuala Lumpur Chiraz this just could be the final game of our second day of competition for the Axiata Cup second game the richest team event in the sport of badminton just about ready to come to a close here in our second day second tie of the day Indonesia versus the Philippines On the court for the second singles is Hayum Rumbaka from Indonesia up against Toby Gadi from the Philippines. <laughs> Philippines racing out a 2 to nothing lead. Hayum Rumbaka took care of business in the first game, 21-9. Just too wide. So it's over. One, two. But Mark Zwiebler there. Can I give even more words of encouragement to Toby Gadi? That goes just wide. So it's over. Three. One. Now Gadi making a little bit more headway here to start our second game. So it's over. Two, three. It's not two, three. You can see Rumbaka just not giving Gadi enough time to recover. Nice attack by Gadi going straight to the body. Of the lanky Rumbaka. That's wide. 
So we saw four. Oh. Just when it looked like that was a point that Gadi should have won. Tombaka turning the tables on him. Easy put away going down the line. Five, four. It's now 5 4. Look at the numbers there, Rumbaka with seven clear winners as compared to two for Gadi. Boy, that time was asking for a little bit too much. So it's over. Five on. There's just no space, no angle. We're tied at five. Again, much quicker is Rumbaka. Gadi's been game. Just comes up short every now and then. That goes long. Another six point on. for Gadi and the Philippines. Six on. We're tied at six. Daddy's got to be just real patient here so as he comes up with another unforced error. Seven, Already 15 six. unforced errors for Toby Gadi. Rumbaka has not done all that well in that department. Also with 11 unforced errors. Good judgment there by Gadi. So Seven on. <laughs> Much better showing here now for the Philippines. In what me might be their last stand here tonight. Another point there for Gadi. Seven. Over eagerness now. Taking over Rumbaka. There's the brain trust of the Philippines. That was Kenny Vic Asuncion on the right. And world number 17, Mark Zwiebler on the left. That's the man leading the charge and calling the shots here for Indonesia Rajawali. Actually Team B. Because Team A of Indonesia is in Jakarta right now competing in their own group stage. Another point here for Gadi and going on, four teams Nine, seeing action in eight. Jakarta, Indonesia is Malaysia, Indonesia, Singapore, and Vietnam. Excellent shot there by Gadi. Ten, and it's now 10-8. Nice put away that time. So it's over. It's now 9-10. Nine, nine, ten. Ten. Well, the top two teams in both these group stages, the one in Kuala Lumpur, which you're watching right now, and the one happening simultaneously in Jakarta. Top two teams will figure out in a crossover semifinals. Home and away. That will be held next weekend. Yeah. 
And another point there for the Philippines brings us to the interval. interval. And a very disappointed Rumbaka there heads on back to the sidelines as he talks to his coach. Watch this piece of action once again. Gotta get dead. Daddy not giving up on that point. Finally winning it for the Philippines. It's 11-9. Not very pleased, Rumbaka heads on back to the court. He trails Toby Gadi by two. Nice shot going cross court. And he's got to change rackets yet again. Already gone to three, two rackets here. That's his third. Smash winners. Five to four in favor of Rumbaka. Back to the action now. Come to you live from the stadium, Badminton Kuala Lumpur, Cheraz, Malaysia. Another lift that goes long. That has been the real Waterloo so far of Rumbaka here tonight. Pushed long likewise here by Gadi. Brings Rumbaka to within one. That's a poor effort there by Gadi. He's got to extend the points. Really push Rumbaka. Very quietly, Rumbaka retakes the lead here. And we're tied once again. And that bit of luck shining Gadi's way. This is the best angle to take a look at it from. And don't look now, but Gadi has retaken the lead. The Philippines yesterday in their tie against Malaysia was able to steal one in the men's doubles. They could to do that here. Come up with that very same feat in the men's singles.
impeccable rally. One that time by Rumbaka. The longest rally of this match. And in the end, it's still the Indonesian showing the way. It's 15 all. This is going to be a sprint to six. Quick recovery there by Rumbaka. 16, and he now 16. pushes forward up by one. Well, this Indonesian squad, Indonesia, Raja Wali, after this win here over the Philippines, has assured itself of 100,000 just to qualify for the semi-finals. The Philippines and Thailand will both take home 50,000 US dollars as group stage losers. There's the rest of Team Philippines. Vivas, Estanislao and Bog Samahit. Easy put away. And it's now 18 to 15. 18, 15. <laughs> it's been a commendable effort here by Toby Gaddy just to stay in step. So it's so 16, 18. And he's still within two. <laughs> now within one. 70, 80. He's not going to go away without a fight. Antonino Toby Gaddy. A good grab that time by Rumbaka just to keep that point alive. And Gadi sends that long. What a tremendous stretch here for Rumbaka. And it brings him two points away from the victory. Gadi now crawls to within one. That goes wide. And it's now game point, match point for Rumbaka in Indonesia. 20, match point, 80. Can Gadi extend this match just a little more? And the question is no. Indonesia match point with a three to nothing victory here over the Philippines. It is a much more competitive second game. Thank you. But in the end, just too much firepower behind the Indonesians. As we watch this final point. Rumbaka ending proceedings here for the second day of the Akshata Cup 2012. 
final score here for our second singles, 21-9, 21-18, Junicius Hayum Rumbaka, the winner over Toby Gadi from the Philippines. Sak Ponsana in the doubles with his Kuo Kien Kiet and Dan Boon Hyong, a winner in three games. And finally, the youngster, the phenom, Jaron Liu, winning in two straight games over Aving Hin Sanon. And in our second tie, Indonesia Rajawali up against the Philippines. 3-0 is our score here. Tommy Sugiarto defeating Vivas, 21-13, 21-8. And then, in the doubles, it was 21-16, 21-7 over Bo and Estanislao. And finally, the match you just witnessed, Rumbaka over Gadi, 21-9, 21-18. And that is our final standings after the first two days of competition. On top, Indonesia Rajawali and Malaysia Tigers as expected, and both qualify for the semifinals next week. Which brings us to a mouth-watering affair tomorrow, Make sure you join us then as Indonesia goes up against Malaysia in the third and final day of the Akshata Cup Group.